In this video, you will learn how to set up standard multiple test versions in Remark Office OMR, which allows you to distribute different versions of a test to minimize the chance of one student copying another student's answers. The standard multiple test versions option matches the data you enter for each student to the corresponding answer key. Note that Remark Office OMR will read the first scanned image as your answer key. In this case, we will be using two test versions that will be read and processed as the first two rows of data. You need a bubble on your test form that indicates which version of the test each student is taking. Begin in your form template with all of your regions defined. Double click on the region containing the exam version. Select the Advanced Region Properties tab. In the Test Settings box, make sure you select to designate as Test Version ID. Please note that when setting up your form template, you should identify the region containing your exam version IDs so Remark can match each student's test to the appropriate answer key. Click OK. If you have designated the test version ID region in your template and scanned your answer keys as the first rows of data, you can simply click Quick Grade and Remark Quick Stats will launch with your tests graded. If you need to configure your test versions, start in the Advanced Grade window. Then click the Answer Key tab. Select an importing option from the drop down list. Then click Import Key. Please note that we have a separate video discussing advanced grade and answer keys in more detail. Click the Test Versions tab. Mark the checkbox to define multiple test versions. Select Standard if it is not already selected. Remark will automatically find and input the region on your form that identifies the test versions in the Which Questions Answer identifies the test versions drop-down list. If not, choose a question from your test that has a value that identifies the test version. Then in the version ID row, Type in the test ID for the first version, or if you scanned your answer keys with the student's tests, import an ID 
by selecting an importing style from the drop-down list. and select Import Key. To create a second test version, click Create Version. You can either manually enter an answer key import it from the scanned data, or scan or read an image file. In this video, we will now show how to import an image file since we imported the first answer key. Click the drop-down list and select Read. Click Import Key. Then select to collect your data by reading images. And click Next. Browse for an image file. Then select an image to process by clicking on the file, and then click Add Selected. Click Read. You will now see the data for test version A and version B. Repeat these steps to add another test version. If desired, click Save slash View to simply view a copy of your answer key as a CSV or text file. To delete an answer key, click Delete Key. Click Grade. If you want to save the answer key, Save it to an easily accessible location. By default, the student statistics report appears. We can see that all of the tests were properly graded based on their respective answer key. All of the standard reports are available. Click Item Analysis Reports. Select Condensed Item Analysis. Here, we can see the breakdown of responses per test version. If you want a single item analysis report for all test versions, you will need to use advanced test versions, which is covered in a separate video. If we look at the student grade report,
add all students then run report we can see the test version that each student took. The remaining reports are also available with grades based on the version of the test taken by each student. You have successfully learned how to set up multiple test versions using the standard option. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for more information. Thanks for watching.